don't know what you're doing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we've just got a new crew member on board. Uh, our mate Rob has just flown in from Australia, so he's going to give us a hand across the Atlantic. So we just get four. Let's get five meters. So we've only got a few more days left in uh, in Portugal before we depart for Morocco. Uh, we've got a few big electrical jobs to do. Well, I've got Rob here to help us. Uh, we've got to fit today a little solar arch, just a cheap basic one, uh, for two more panels, uh, rewire them, and uh, we've got four new batteries that we've got to wire up um, to replace our old ones just before we cross. So what's this one going to do? It's going to tell us a big number of what voltage we're at and how much we're using. Yeah, that'll be handy. We'll just meet them straight there, straight onto the negative terminal. Good to have an electrician on board. So good. It's got to all work first. <laughs> So we're all finished now with our new battery and charging system. Rob has been kind enough to help us wire it up. We didn't have a lot of space to work with here in the aft cabin, uh, but we managed to fit in four six volt batteries, 460 amp hours in total. Uh, we've done series and parallel, and we've also put in a Victron 30 amp charge controller for the, for the four panels that we're running, and a shunt here for the NASA battery monitor so we can keep an eye on everything. We're pretty happy with how everything turned out and we should be able to give it a good test run on the way down from Portugal to Morocco. Where are we going? Uh, just leaving Lagos. Off to Morocco. We've got like 400 miles, I think. And we should be able to put the sails up soon. You ready? Yeah. As ready as I'll ever be, I think.
How are you feeling after your first few hours? Ah, uh, been better. <laughs> bit dusty? Yeah, a little dusty. Been doing Sam? Nothing. <laughs> Absolutely nothing. We've got a steady. Yeah. It's horrible. It's like worse than having 35 knots. I prefer to have 35. How was your first night at sea? Yeah, it's a bit of a rough start. <laughs> <laughs> Spent most of the time swinging off the edge of the boat. Yeah. <laughs> Still a bit of noodles left on the back of the boat. Yeah. <laughs> Save them for a rainy day. Feeling better now? Yeah, a lot better. Yeah, the sea state's a lot better. And we are expecting the wind to pick back up again tonight, tomorrow morning. Tonight. Sounds like it would work, or at least on this angle you could just turn a bit more that way. Yeah. You read it online, haven't you? That people do it. I've read it a lot. Yeah, I've seen videos of people doing it more on like race boats and that. Especially if you're zooming far forward quite fast, the apparent wind is actually more where that. See the windex at the top. That's that's only apparent wind. So this is what the boat's feeling because we're moving forward. It's blowing from behind us more but we're creating a little bit of wind to make it more this angle. Yeah. So as long as you let that go out now and then lifted it up on the topping lift, you should be able to read yeah. downwards anyway. Sam sailing school. So <laughs> Status update, Rob. Status update. What day are we on? Uh, day Two and a half, I think. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure. Yeah. What is it's been a bit of a wobbly old ride. Yeah. Hopefully she picks up a bit and get a good day in today. And you got the fishing rod up. Yeah. No bites yet. What Lucky. sail plan do you have up? Not a very good one. <laughs> <laughs> We're not going very fast. We've got the main reef and the Genaria. Hoping it gets a little windier. Still pretty light. Still doing about average five knots. What are you reading? Sapiens, a uh, brief history of human kind. Brief? How brief? Doesn't look brief. It's not very brief. Nine, really 900 good. pages of just a summary. No, it's really good. It's very interesting. I keep reading the same sections over again. Because it's a lot to take in.
Where's your life jacket? Boys are getting the spinnaker pole ready. Getting the sails trimmed right? Yeah, trimming them up. <laughs> <laughs> so what sail configuration do we have at the moment? Hold out the Genoa head sail. Yeah. And then we've tied back the main sail on second reef and we've got the storm jib half filled out, heading direct downwind. Sweet. Outside Morocco, and we have about 100 miles to go to uh, Agadir, and we're expecting to get there tomorrow midday. Hopefully, if we keep the speed. Yeah. 
we've had 72 hours from from Lagos, Lagos. in Portugal. Yeah. And Pretty slow trip, and we got some good sailing. Nice weather. Yeah, we had no wind the first 24 hours, uh, but then we got some good wind on the second day. And now we're just entering in Agadir. We have to. This is actually the first place we've been to where we have to check into the country. So we got a little queue flag up for the first time.